Here we have few interesting application problems on ratios. The first one, A1. What number should be added to each term of the ratio 2 is to 5 so that the result is equivalent to 3 is to 4? Do you understand the question? What term should be added to each term? What number should be added to each term of the ratio 2 is to 5 so that the result is equivalent to 3 is to 4. So let the term added be, let the number added be x, correct? Then, so if we have a ratio of 2 is to 5, right? So we have some ratio which is 2 over 5 so, so the ratio was 2 over 5, correct? Now what we did was, in this ratio, we added same number x. That means we made it like 2 plus x over 5 plus x. So when you add x to both, then it becomes 3 over 4. Then it becomes 3 over 4. That is the question, right? So this is what we are looking for. So what number x should we add to this ratio of 2 over 5 so that we get a new ratio of 3 is to 4. So this is the question, correct? So let's try to solve this problem now. So to find this number, let's cross multiply, okay? So when we cross multiply, we get 2 plus x times 4 equals to 5 plus x times 3, correct? Now let's open this bracket. 4 times 2 is 8 and 4 times x is 4x. So when you open the bracket, you have to multiply this 4 with both the numbers, right? I've seen students making a mistake here, right? Similarly with 3, you have to multiply with both, correct? So that this is equal to 5 times 3, 15 plus 3x, correct? Now we have to solve this. To solve this, we have to bring like terms together, correct? So we can take away 3x bring it on this side and take away 8 from here, right? So that is how we will solve it, right? So if we take away 3x, we get what? So let me write this step as like this. 8 plus 4x minus 3x equals to 15 plus 3x minus 3x, correct? So we get this. Let me do it on the right side. So we have 8 plus x. 8 plus x equals to 15. Now to find x, let's take away 8, right? So we have 8 plus x minus 8 equals to 15 minus 8, correct? So we have x is equals to 15 minus 8 as 7. Do you see that? So our new term will be after adding 7 to 2 to 5. So let's check this term. If I add 2 plus 7 is how much? 2 plus 7 is 9. And 5 plus 7 is 12. Now what is the ratio? 9 over 12 is equal to, you can divide both by 3 and get 3 over 4. Do you see that? So that is how you can get the ratio 3 over 4. Do you see that? So the term to be added, the number to be added to each term is seven and that is how we do it okay i hope you appreciate the method thank you